Hey guys, today I'm going to show y'all what's in my June clean bag. Um, it came in the mail a lot later than normal. Um, like so late I didn't think I would actually get one. For some reason, it's been in my town for about a week, yet I only got it in the mail today. I was checking the tracking info every single day, and it only came today, so I don't know what was up with that. But anyway, I got it today, and I'm very excited. So, yeah, um... This is what it looks like. It's just all gold and sparkly with a little snap to open it. Um, you know, it, it's got that weird smell that all glam bags have, you know. Not the highest quality bag, but I like them. They tend to have cute patterns most of the time. So, yeah. Um, first thing in the glam bag is the Living Proof No Frizz Nourishing Styling Cream. It says it stops frizz, period. Weightlessly blocks humidity, smooths, and conditions no heavy silicones or oils. And this is like a two fluid ounce container. So, yeah. It's not that big, but for a hair product, it's pretty good size. At least it's not in one of those like little foil packet things. Those things are just annoying. Because sometimes they'll give you enough for two uses, but what are you going to do with the rest of it when you're done with one use? Yeah. So... Yeah, and it just, you know, opens like this and squirts out of there. And I will say this, it smells pretty good. I took a shower after I got the glam bag in the mail. Like, I was planning on taking a shower anyway. And I decided to try it out before I dried my hair. And it worked pretty good. I mean, I haven't really noticed a cutback on frizz. But then again, haven't really done anything too exhausting of my hair. Like, go outside in the humidity. To test it out but so far I like it um so yeah next thing is the philosophy take a deep breath oil free energizing oxygen gel cream moisturizer I've tried this also before I put on my makeup but pretty much everything in the glam bag I used today well yeah basically um <laughs> I like this it's not really anything different from my regular moisturizer but um you know, it's a good thing to try or to travel with if you don't feel like taking your big moisturizer with you or something like that. And it, again, actually doesn't really have a smell, <laughs> but yeah. Um, so that's that. And the next two things I got really excited about um, because they are actual makeup products. And I love makeup. It's my passion, as you could probably tell by the fact that the only videos I do are about makeup, mainly. So, yeah, but, um, it, it, this one is the Marbella Permanent Eyeliner Pen. Um, it just looks like this. It's a full size with the tip like this, and it's, yeah, it works pretty well. I have tried the e.l.f. eyeliner pen before. And it was horrible. <laughs> but um, that is really good. So I may try to use that more. Um, and last but not least is the NYX Round Lipstick in the shade Georgia. So, yeah. And it's just a really pretty, like, frosty pink. I don't really go for frosty pinks most of the time. I usually go for a cream finish. But I really like this on me. So, yeah, I think it's good for summertime. Um, at least it looks good with bronzer on my skin, so, yeah, and that's coming off a lot brighter than it really is on camera, but, yeah, um, so yeah, I like the glam bag this month, um, you know, it's pretty good, obviously not exciting as the first glam bag was, but, I mean, that one was pretty much all makeup products, this was only two, but still, good, good thing, um, to have, uh, I don't really know if I have a favorite in this month's glam bag. It may either be the eyeliner or the lipstick just because I've discovered a love for NYX products recently and the fact that I have a new NYX round lipstick is pretty awesome because yeah, I, there was a different color that I wanted that Michelle Fawn used in her um, video for my glam and I can't remember what it was, but it was like cream soda or orange soda or orange creamsicle pop or something like that. Um, 
and it was like sort of that creamy orange color of a orange creamsicle and I really thought it was really pretty on her and yeah but I kind of have one like that it's more of just a neutral shade but anyway yeah so I like the products in this month's glam bag and I cannot wait until next month's so yeah I will see you guys later um I will be planning on putting up a few more makeup tutorials so check those out when they go up so yeah bye guys